Greetings musicians and friends and other beings occupying the multiverse. I'm Robert. And I'm Josh. And we're at A&G Central Music and we'd like to have a conversation with you. Yes, right now. In fact. It's happening. You can't stop, well potentially you could stop it by not watching the video, but you're not going to do that. Yeah. Well you could leave it on and walk away and I think that would be okay. Yeah. And just put it on repeat. It's, it's good for us. Listen, yeah. Josh, uh, do you think that um, in the multiverse there's another version of us that isn't as awkward as we are here? No. But maybe there's other multiverses that do or don't have marching band. Or, like, do it in the winter instead of the summer. That would be weird. Snow band sleds and stuff i don't know that'd be adventurous well it is summer here and in this particular universe we yes. can call this universe 337 i assume it's safe to say it is for you yeah yeah we do have marching band coming up that's for sure what do you what do you need for marching band well um i would say obviously you need physical supplies your instrument you need to make sure it's in good working order um, do you need some eight to five? Oh yeah, yeah. You need to practice your eight and five, eight to five. If That's you know, important. you know. Eight to five, five to five, one to five. If for those of us who are really athletic, um, you know. And <laughs> oh yeah, and don't forget, like you, you know, you probably have like sunblock and a hat and a water bottle all those things are important maybe some physical activity over the summer practice your instrument memorize your music all that marching band stuff do you remember the first time that you did marching band i do i was really pumped to play iron man were you apprehensive at all because it's so different than everything that you'd done prior to that you know i wasn't because i'm pro i'm a really special human but i think there's probably a lot of people out there who who are, especially going from like the eighth grade band, a very different experience. The social atmosphere and everything that's involved in doing marching band. You know, the great thing, at least in my experience and experience I've witnessed in others about starting marching band is that apprehension goes away really quickly. Yeah. Because you very quickly are, you know, when you start marching band, mm -hmm. you're thrown in uh, as a new, like say an incoming freshman or eighth grader, depending on you know, where you go to school, right. you're thrown in with a new group of people, but they very, very quickly become family because you spend so much time so closely together. It's a really great experience, right. I feel like. And working towards a common goal, right? Yeah. And I think, too, that's really valuable because you're doing that over the summer. So when you, you know, especially as a eighth, ninth grader going up to high school for the first time, like you already have a group of friends that you'll see in your classes of upperclassmen. Mm -hmm makes it a lot more familiar and a lot easier to kind of transition to. Yeah, right. That first day of school, a lot of the mystery is gone, right? You have friends already. What? It's great. Well, I, many of us, Josh, <laughs> have friends. Oh. All right. Favorite memory of marching band, go. Oh, man. Well, I was drum major in high school, and um, I kind of remember. Check I think out Mr. Fancy Pants. <laughs> I think just kind of learning to conduct and all, th all those experiences and leadership um, really were valuable for me when I went off to go to college to study music. So I don't think I can say something specific, but that experience as a whole was very important to me. Still have those conducting chops. Why don't you, why don't you send us on our way? Um, maybe conduct a little Iron Man for us. Folks, right, if you right. appreciate these videos, like and subscribe, it really helps us out. We're gonna see you soon. Here I, it comes. I don't think I can do it without my whistle. Marching band. <laughs> <laughs> you don't think you could do one to five? <laughs> That's not the problem. I'm just envisioning you doing one to five with your level of commitment. <laughs> I just break my knees. <laughs> I just picture kids and instruments being strewn across the 
scorching field. I'm still trying to play. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Shh.